Hey, what's up? It's me again. Uh, sorry about that, but YouTube is gay and won't let you have videos past 10 minutes. So, um, yeah, here's the rest of how to play the rest of the song. Um, after a while of hitting the slap line and then going into the chorus, you're going to have the outro. And uh, before you go into the outro, you're just going to hold out a three on the A. And then you go into the outro, which is... Which is basically just a C power chord, which is three on um, three on the A string. Then you're gonna have five on the D string and five on the G string. So it's um, the rhythm is and you're gonna want to let it ring out, but it's pretty much just that until you get to the end. And the end it starts to get crazy, like um, you're just having power chords. If you're asking what I'm doing, is I like the style. It's kind of like I picked it up from uh, uh, Fieldy off of Corn. It's kind of where he does like this on his strings. He like sl like flicks at all the strings, like and it gives it a really trebly sound. And um, and if you do it with your thumb, you get a really bassy sound. So it's up to you guys how you want to do that, but um. Basically, all a power chord is, is, um, it's gonna be five, like, okay, I'll give you an example. This is a D power chord, okay? It's gonna be five on the A, and then seven on the D. That's your power chord. So when I say D power chord, that's what you play, or five on the A power chord. And then it's just gonna be like that no matter where you go. So five on the A power chord, four on the A power chord, which is just moving everything up one fret, then move everything up one fret again to a C power chord. So you have D, C sharp, C. So basically five, four, three. And then after that you have, which is just three on the A, and then four on the A, and now. And then after you do that like six times, you're gonna hit after. Just gonna hit five on the A, hold it out the last time, and then end. So that's pretty much it. If I confuse the hell out of any of you out there watching, which I'm pretty sure I did, probably around the time when I first started talking. Um, <laughs> yeah, I have a good knack for confusing people. So if I did, just send me a message. I'm always glad to help you guys out. And um, if you have any requests, I have a lot of books, you know. Base books, I'm not a nerd, but you know. <laughs> um, but yeah, just send me a request or anything, or if you have any questions or, you know, just questions about advice and stuff, you know, send me them. I'm glad to hear them. And uh, subscribe if you like the videos, more to come. I do it frequently, even though now it's kind of hard with school and jazz band and, you know, just everything, you know. But um, yeah, I make videos frequently, so go ahead and subscribe. So yeah, thanks for watching.